The Bookmarks Commander extension is a fast, easy to use dual pane bookmarks manager. To go ahead and start using this extension, first we add it to our browser. After this has been added to our browser, we can then pin it to the toolbar. To do this, we left click on the puzzle icon and then left click on the pin. Now you'll see the option inside the browser toolbar to have the bookmarks commander. Now there are two options you can do here. You can left click this or right click it. If we go ahead and right click, we can see the three basic options, which basically says, do we want to open the commander in a new tab, a new window or a pop up? So we're going to keep this as the default in a new tab. Now when we go ahead and left click, it opens the bookmark commander inside a new tab. And here we can see it, the dual panes next to each other, one on the left, one on the right. Now this works either by clicking or you can use your keyboard. So you can click left or right or you can use left and right on your keyboard to switch between the two. You can double click on an entry or you can press enter on an entry. So it comes with dual functionality. You can then also have the options down the bottom here, such as the root option. So let's go ahead and see how this works as standard. So if we go to a website, for example, um, Wikipedia. Now upon visiting Wikipedia, we go ahead and bookmark as normal. And we select the folder that we want it to appear in. So we have bookmarks bar and other bookmarks. Go ahead and add this. Now when we return, if we go ahead and click into the bookmarks bar, we'll see Wikipedia has been added to this list. Upon this being added to the list, we can also see options below. So they are the ability to copy the title, copy the link, edit the title, edit the link, and then create a new bookmark and directory. So for example, if we go ahead and click copy the title, now we go to notepad. Upon pasting, you'll see the title here. If we go ahead and we click to copy the link, go to Notepad and paste this here. And we can see now we have the link. So there's a quick shorthand there. You'll also see you have the shorthand um, hot links as well. So you've got the X and the C. So if we go ahead and copy this with the capitalized X, so we press Control and X or CMD and X, and we go ahead and paste, you can see this now copies Google, or if we do ahead and do the capital C, go ahead and press that. And now we can see the link has been pasted into here as well. We can also edit the title if we wanted to. So we could call this Google uh, new. And uh, we can see this has changed. And we can also edit the link as well. And we can go ahead and change this as well. So we change this to .co.uk as an example. We also have the ability to create a new bookmark directly here with the title, as well as a new directory if we wanted to create individual folders. We also have the ability to click through to go back to the root, and we can also mirror on the right hand side. So let's say for example, we're in other bookmarks here. If we go ahead and click mirror, we can see that it picks up the same look on each side, go back to the root, and the same thing happens again. Now the great thing about this tool is that you can also look in different folders at the same time. So for example, let's go ahead and go to msn.com. Let's go ahead and bookmark this and let's put it inside other bookmarks. Now, here we can look inside the bookmark bar and here we can look inside other bookmarks and we can easily see the dual pane allows us to look at our bookmarks, search through them, look on individual pane and really help us to manage them much better than the default kind of bookmark status or manager of our browser.